Hi, I'm Pat McGarry. We're here at uh, Reno Air Races, and uh, this is uh, biplane race 7X. It's a pit special, and uh, this will be pretty typical of uh, Pitts aircraft. This is a st very stock-looking S1S, four-cylinder like homing. Um, up front, uh, fixed pitch prop. All the uh, engine oil up to eight quarts is contained in the engine in the sump. Uh, got a uh, four to one exhaust. That's the big exhaust on the bottom. Uh, access to the engine could be either through the uh, cowling here, and uh, or up through the uh, for fire suppression. Yeah, exhaust area. Um, two fuel tanks, 19 gallons in here, and this is. Uh, a little thermos style cap and uh, that's kind of right over my legs in the cockpit and then an ox tank which is not normally used for racing so 4.5 gallons in the top wing um, okay so the canopy is actually a real thin uh, plexiglass uh, in an emergency be super easy to break uh, watch for my head and uh, if it's not an emergency tabs on both sides lift up and it just slides back and uh, there's your pilot. Um, in here, this is the fuel tank I was talking about, which is literally right over my legs. <clears throat> uh, master switch on the left. Battery power switch is uh, up is on, and down is off. Left. Mag switches, which this aircraft are kind of backwards. You have to read the label, up is off. And um, to uh, remove the belts, this is a dual lap belt and uh, really simply lift up on these two quick release latches everything falls apart this is a real common five point harness for uh, actually a seven point for a aerobatic airplane this is the uh, bottom half of the 19 gallon fuel tank which is located right over my legs uh, the fuel shutoff is down here on this uh, wobble pump fuel selector and forward is the off position shut the fuel off to the engine on its back unfortunately um, really easy to grab these are real strong the stabilizers you can uh, use those as handles to clip it back over and get it upright on its wheels 